Hello and welcome everyone. My name is Mech2009. And right now we are playing Days Gone on the PS4. Now I'm at a point in the game to where I'm at the bottom of the map, specifically the bottom left. Over by the Spruce Lake Nero checkpoint or the ambush camp. And right down here as I was facing, there is a tunnel with hordes. Sorry, singular horde in it. And uh, they seem to just keep respawning. They don't count towards the horde count on the uh, map here. So it's just a farm. That's all I can conclude. Uh, I'm going to show you how to take them out really the most effective way. The easiest way. Simplest way, let's put it that way. Because all you're going to need are three gas cans, which there's one around the corner. Pick up you. Uh, here we go. Never gets old. We're going to place them, r all of them, well, two of them at least, right underneath this tower. The second one we're going to get is right here at the tow truck. And you can place it pretty much anywhere. Um, <laughs> within blast radius, really. And I'm going to place a remote bomb. And you are going to need remote bombs to do this farm. Uh, I'll place it right there. That should be good. And there's going to be a third one right in here next to the building. Right around the corner. So if uh, just word of advice, if you're gonna throw it here, you're gonna explode this bomb that was sitting here. But you open up the gate, so that's good and bad because n if you run out of materials and things to throw, and you still have half the horde underneath you. You don't have a, a scapegoat to get out unless you could run. Um, but yeah, you're gonna need those. Remote bomb, and also I would recommend an attractor. As you will see here, well, as soon as we get these guys out. You could really use anything else, but these seem to do just fine. Hello? Please come to me. Come on. Okay, yeah, now we start running. <laughs> Most of them should be behind us. Oops. Wrong button. If not, yep, all of them. Okay, one straggler. Ah, there we go. He's coming. He's coming around. So as you can see, they are all underneath us. That's gonna light them. And it, it doesn't take them all out. But it get rid it does get rid of quite a few. Oh, there's one more. Okay. So this is where we're gonna use the extraction. Place it right there. That's fine. Hopefully they won't kick you. And they go through here. Yeah. I'm still working. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, there's still quite a bit down there. Alright, we're gonna use another one. We're gonna put some good stuff. And we're just gonna use one of our bombs, pipe bombs. You can use, oops, you can use a grenade or a uh, napalm. But to be honest, I think it's just gonna work just fine Yeah, with that. And that's pretty much it. There's your easy XP right there. Easy money. You, if you killed one, you can always run up here and get them. You don't need to. 
but it helps to get the full bounty. So. And now all I do is I just roll out to the gas station. Hopefully no marauders are sitting there. Ah, <sighs> they've clotheslined me, sniped me, all sorts of things. So let's take a ride real quick, and I will show you. Actually, yeah, I'll show you. All you got to do is just roll just up north. And what you could do even is just run up this dirt path and just do a circle on back. And that should be good enough. have our new set of zombies waiting for us inside. Yep, and there they are. Oops. Okay, I was not ready for this. Anyways, that is my suggestion and tip for you guys to get some really easy XP. I'm gonna take these guys out the hard way. Um, Anyways, I hope this helped you guys out. Uh, please leave a like if it did. And uh, I'll see you next time. Take it easy, everyone. Ah!